What's good, YouTube? Today we got with Miss Stop Sipping. Okay, Shakir. City boys. I have a question for you. All right. Do you want to get married? Do I want to get married? Yeah. Right now, no. When that time comes. I propose to you, you know when. I I respect that answer 115%. I'm not gonna rush into anything because you want me to do it. I feel like I feel like some women, keyword some. I gotta put I'm gonna make sure when I'm editing this, I'm gonna put keyword some. Some women they they like to force the man to do what they want them to do, especially in regards of the relationship. You cannot rush a bond, you cannot rush uh, marriage, can't rest none of that stuff, so I respect that answer. Wait, if you are getting married though, bro, you have to sign a prenup, bro. Oh, we both have to sign a prenup. Look at her face. I don't got time for that half half, yeah, man. Everything that I make and everything that is mine is going towards me, everything that you make and everything that is yours is going towards you. Yo, I got time for that shit, bro. but so why? What do you mean, why? What do you mean we have to sign one? Yo, so if I'm not mistaken, look, I'm not the best guy to you know. To, to talk the relationship talk because you know truth be told I've never really been in one but if I'm not mistaken a prenuptial agreement is where both parties agree to leave with what they came in with if I'm not mistaken let me know in the comments below if you know if you know something different but um yeah I mean I feel like that's cool right so like hypothetically me right obviously I'm gonna be this rich and famous YouTuber right um, if I come into it like that and you come in like bare minimum and shit, like I believe that you should leave it with game one. Unless, unless we come to a different agreement, but in the beginning, most definitely, because I don't know if you down, 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 down. You might see the vision trying to ride the wave, you feel me? Because I want everything there's that no I work but for. There's no reason to sign one. There is a reason. I want everything that I so work for. So you're planning on leaving me? No, you you're no, you missing it. You missing it. You missing it. No, there's no other reason. It's not about that. That you would want to sign. It's not about that. It's not about Bro, that. If it's my money, I want my money to be my money. If it's your money, your money can be your money. Your money. So therefore, we're signing a prenup if you get married. Take it or leave but it. But the only what I get from it, right? What I get from from this, uh, man's man's wasn't like he wasn't like I don't know, pause. He wasn't really like. It's not about he he plan on leaving you. I keep pausing. He plan on leaving you. It's, that's not what it's about. It's a it's a bigger picture to it, and you missing it. And the fact that you pressing the prenup, you, you press for it. Like you you showing that you depending on the prenup. Advice to men: Look for a wife, not a girlfriend. Seventy percent divorce rates. <laughs> yeah, seventy percent divorce rate the last forty years. 80% of women file all divorces, 93% of college-educated women file for divorce, 90% of men lose custody battles, my advice to men, intermarriage is on risk. That is the gospel, my dude, that he, that boy is preaching, I believe in that 100%, and, and it's, it's statistically proven, you know what I'm saying? I feel like, but this goes, this goes with what I said a little bit earlier, uh, women like to like basically force the narrative, right? So even in the last clip, the girl was so concerned about him leaving her. Um, but in reality, like I say, we looking at the numbers right here, we looking at the numbers, it's the women that do it. You know what I'm saying? Like that's, that's crazy, bro. I don't blast my personal shit on social media. It's not for everyone to consume, bro. Right. Like chicks do that. They right. blast all their personal show on social media like it's for everybody to right. consume. Dudes don't do that, bro. Right. And I, I believe that 100%, bro. Uh, at the end of the day, we grown men. This internet shit, it's, uh, it's, it, you create the persona, you create the, uh, you create your, your person, your personality on the internet, man. This internet shit fake, bro. I'm a real person at the end of the day. I'm a real man. You got a problem with me, come, come holler at me, bro. Like, it's as simple as that. You can get with me. You feel me? You can, you, can, you can get in touch with me if you really got a problem. You feel me? Some men had to realize they're only needed for don't nobody want to love you, bruh. Wow. Look, most men just want to hit them cheeks, then they back to the streets anyway. That's why we always got women crying about how they can't find a good man. But women, y'all need to come to the realization that a lot of y'all are not girlfriend material. At all. A lot of y'all will never find a man. Never. A lot of y'all are not wifey material because a lot of women are delusional. I, I agree with men's though. Men's got a, a valid point, man. A lot of women um truly feel like that, that, that we're only good for, you know, Good for our, our, our private area, but I mean that's I mean it's a, it's a, it's a it go hand in hand. You know what I'm saying? I feel like uh some women are only worth their vagina. You know, excuse me. You know I'm not trying to offend nobody, but it's the reality of the situation. But let a man had said that though. 
Let a man say that some women are only that we they don't want we don't want to love you. We just want your pee. Like, bro, what? Like, <laughs> people people will be canceled. We'll be canceled so fast, yeah, well, bro. There you go. False part. As soon as as soon as your woman wants sleep, you might as well just leave. <laughs> yeah. You literally, if your woman's yeah, saying exactly. I'm not, just leave. Yeah. Wait, I didn't hear what you said. As soon as as soon as your woman wants sleep, you might as well just leave. Yeah. You literally, if your woman's yeah, saying exactly. I'm not, just leave. Yeah. yeah you yeah. know, and leave with some honor. I have the exact same opinion. <laughs> you know. Yo, most definitely. I feel like I feel like you know it's no reason why you shouldn't want to have sex with me. Honestly speaking, unless you're getting it elsewhere. That's 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 just the valid the validity. <laughs> of, of everything. If you ain't getting it from me, you get it from somebody else. And that's just that's just a hundred. That's just being like all the way one hundred. Like, yeah, get a bro. Get, you know what get people talking in front of me of because I like my girl feet, like her toes. You saw them? Yeah, I saw my girl toes. Okay. You enjoy that? Shit. Okay. I mean, you like it more than her? Yeah. yeah. I don't know. You enjoy that? Shit, right? It's it's not it's. I mean, yeah. Hey, 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 like what you like, bro. That was pretty too. You just gotta. You just lick your I, lips. I, like you. Gotta, I, I ain't think about it. it. I ain't think about it. That barefoot. That barefoot. I got some toes waiting for me. Yeah, yeah. Toes. Nah, and I never will. Damn, not even a little bit. Feet are for the flow, you feel me? Oh. Every time I'm trying to see my your feet is when I lift your legs up. You feel me? Hey, you feel me? Respect. Respectfully, uh, me personally, I'm not a toes guy, but like, if 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 I love you and I care about you and I care about pleasing you, I, it's no limit to where I will go. Hey yo, what the fuck? Now, Grant, I'm not doing no butt stuff, like as far as my butt go. You feel me? But uh, I mean, if you into the butt stuff, then that's just that's just what it is. But you know, like I say, I feel like in a relationship, it's about the man pleasing the woman to an extent. You know what I'm saying? I know I believe it. It can be reciprocated, but my my thing in relationships or when I'm talking to somebody or dating, like somebody really tough, um, I want you to be 100% pleased and I don't want you to, I'm, I'm terrified <laughs> of getting cheated on. Emotional, damn it. I'm so scared to get cheated on, bro. So like, hey, if I gotta, hey man, if I gotta lick some toes just for you to feel secure, hey, fuck it, I'ma do it. I'm licking them toes, baby. Go ahead, get them French tips, and you can get this French kiss. You dig what I'm saying, respectfully? He used to deal me, you know, me. You should have replied, hey, no capo. A lot of a lot of these, like, and I will never understand why that matters. Why does that matter? So, quick little story time, right? I remember, I remember I told this girl that she looked beautiful, right? I believe in, see, as, as a black man in the black community, <laughs> not to make it about race, but I feel like it's so tough for us to just compliment people without having to have hidden agendas, hidden motives, right? I complimented her. I said, you look really beautiful. And I think she might have said thank you, whatever the case is. And I guess at some point in time, I used to talk to or date like one of the one of her homegirls or something. So... Uh, she hits me up. The homegirl hits me up talking about, um, yeah, you tried to talk to my homegirl. That's weird. I was like, who's your homegirl? And she, she said, the girl. And I was like, bro, what? I, was like, I didn't try to talk to her. And then she was like, yeah, she said you DM'd her. I said, bro, I complimented her. I would, that's, that's as far as it went. That's as far as it went. When she replied, if I was trying to holler at her, I could have kept going. I could have kept it going. I said what I said. I said, hey, you look really nice. Thank you. And that's what it was. That's not me trying to holler. Ladies, stop getting that misconstrued. Just because a guy says you look nice or says you look cute or gives you a compliment, bro, that is not us trying to holler at you, bro. We just literally giving you a compliment. I hate the black community has has this this whole mentality, bro. That shit is... is Bonkers, man. I said bonkers. That's the only, that's the only word I can, I can say that that uh that make the most sense to me. You know what I'm saying? Bonkers. Dependency is no laughing matter. Me Addiction to, to a bitch can your friends, your health, and scary enough even your Cat money. Williams. Cat, hey, so look. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, I probably I need some water, y'all. I need some water. But uh, yo, I, I believe in that wholeheartedly. Wholeheartedly, um. I'm not used to one of my biggest flaws um, while dating is a uh, lack of communication. I don't believe that I have to communicate 24/7 um, about what I'm doing and things like that. But a lot of women 
don't understand that it's not us ignoring you. It's not us not wanting to spend time with you. It's not none of that. It's 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 truly just, you know, we have a life, right? So like, I'm a YouTuber, obviously. I'm a YouTuber. I'm a reactor. I'm a nerdcore artist. I'm I'm all of this stuff, right? I'm a, I'm an influencer. All this, right? I was all of this before I met you. <laughs> I was all of this. So sometimes I have I ha I well not sometimes. At some point throughout the day, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to focus on this, right? I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to work. My work is unconventional because I don't do I don't have a nine to five. I don't have to clock in, punch somebody clock or anything like that. I have my own schedule. That is true. But at some point, I'm gonna I have my hands in so much stuff that I ha I have to move around. I, I I have to go in my I have to focus, right? So I remember one time I was um. I was uh, in a video with uh, with Mikey and Aaron, and I was like, you know, I'm texting back, and um, I'm gonna text back right now. Actually, I gotta text my cousin back. Um, I was uh, I was in a video, and I, I'm texting in the video, and in the comments, they was they were demolishing me. Yeah, who? Why is he all in his phone? And I remember that. And and since then, moving forward, bro, I just leave my phone is right here. It's right on, it's on the desk. You know, people text me and that's just what it is. But I'm, I'm gonna get these reactions done. I'm gonna get this content done. And you gotta respect that. It's not me ignoring you, bro. But at the end of the day, how, who are you? Who are you to get in front of my money, get between my money?